Hi, welcome back to our tutorial. Today we're going to discuss looping structures in Java. This will be our following objectives. We're going to understand how looping statement uh, is used to shorten repetitive tasks. We will use do while, while and for loop statement. We simulate how a looping statement works and even construct a looping statement with another looping statement. <clears throat> there are some cases where we need to execute the same set of codes all over again to meet the requirement of the program. Retyping same statements makes our program cumbersome and longer. Long programs are not easy to maintain and slows down the reader in understanding. Consider the following requirement. We design program I love you that displays I love you message three times. Normally, the approach of the beginner programmer who is just learning to program is to execute three system dot out dot print ln I love you to meet the requirement. So this time we're going to create our program. Launch Eclipse. Collapse my first in Java. Collapse er, SRC. Select, click Java package. Then we click File, New, Class. We type the name of our program. Copy the block. Save it. And run. This one. The requirement of the program changes over time, and the requirement have changed to display the message 50 times. Are we going to code 50 times of system.out.println to meet the re that requirement? That is not an efficient approach. We will now employ the use of three looping statements to address the issue on three different approaches. While loop statement pretests a boolean expression before executing the statement under its block. Boolean expression is a condition placed inside the parentheses after the while statement. If the condition is true, the statement underneath within the block is executed. Then it will loop back on the condition and test again. If the condition is false, the while statement terminates, exits from the block, and execute the next statement. To control the number of times the, loop, the while loop executes, we need to place a variable or a counter to test the condition of the statement. We have now a syntax. Let us modify and apply the while statement on our I love you program.
let us save this one and run it we have the same output let us study how the looping occurs within the program our variable CTR will store an initial value of 0. The next step is to evaluate the condition associated with the while statement. The question is, is CTR less than 3? Since we have just assigned value 0 to CTR, 0 is less than 3. If the condition is true, the program executes the block statements within the braces. This time, the program executes system.out.println, I love you, displaying the, message, displaying the message. CTR increments by 1. As the figure suggests, reaching the closing brace of the while statement forces the program to loop back and evaluate the while condition again. Is CTR less than 3? Our CTR has a value 1. As the condition becomes true again, 1 is less than 3, it will display I love you for the second time. Increment again CTR, making CTR equal to 2. Loop back again after reaching the closing brace. Is CTR less than 3? True. CTR is 2. That makes it less than 3. Execute the system.out.println. I love you for the third time. Add 1 to CTR. CTR now is 3. Closing brace again is reached. Loop back to the while. CTR less than 3 statement. Is CTR less than 3? Since our CTR has a value of 3, that makes the condition false. The false result exits the while statement block and executes the next statement outside it. There is no, no instruction after the while statement. The program terminates. How about 50 I love you's? Well, if you just change 3 with 50, inside the while condition and you're up and running. So is it possible to make it 10,000 or a million? Yes, of course. Let's make this run. So you have 50 I love yous. Hi, this is Jerry. Thank you for watching this video. If you'd like to see the script or codes of this tutorial, please click the link below. Do visit us on our Facebook and Twitter account. Don't forget to hit the like buttons.